Hello, my name's Irily. I'm a physiotherapist and I want to share with you how my practice has been revolutionised since completing an online course with Georgie Oldfield at SERPA based on the mind-body approach. We all know that pain is complex and that stress and emotions are involved in the experience, but would it surprise you to learn they can commonly be the actual source of the pain and not just the reaction to it? This is because unexpressed emotions and stress activate the autonomic nervous system and the physiological effects of this can cause a myriad of symptoms. The mind-body approach is the treatment of choice for patients who fulfill the following criteria. One, they haven't sustained acute trauma of overload or overload resulting in structural damage. Two, there are no red flags. Three, the pain is chronic or four, the pain may have occurred after an innocuous movement or for no apparent reason. We all know the body heals and that it's more robust than many patients believe. So this history does not point to structural damage as the explanation for pain. You may also note in their history they have other illnesses that are stress related such as migraines, IBS, eczema, reflux, asthma and hay fever for example. I'm not saying the pain is in their head, it is real and often excruciating and experienced in the tissues. But having done the mind-body course, I now understand that in these cases, the local structures aren't damaged and this process is fully reversible. Instead, what has happened is a pain alarm has been activated by the stress response and then maintained by learned neural pathways and altered movement and behavioral patterns. I'm sure you would agree to cure anything, it's important to identify and then address the source of the problem. If you just treat symptoms at best, you may achieve some temporary ease. It's like having a water leak in your bathroom floor and treating the symptoms is like throwing towels down to soak up the water. Wouldn't it make more sense to call the expert who can trace back to the source of the leak and fix that? And wouldn't you want to be that expert who solves the underlying problem in the nervous system? You may have some initial scepticism, but all these concepts are supported by research and incredible clinical outcomes for thousands of patients. This could be a paradigm shift in your career as it has been for mine. And if you're intrigued to learn and train about the mind-body approach, I promise you that your patients' lives and your practice will be transformed. Thank you for listening.